it's your boy named Jarvis Davis here, and hey man, I got full permission, and I asked the person who owns this channel, can I react to his video? And the person said yes, the original link would be in the description, man, y'all know what time it is, man, and let's go ahead and get this party started, let's get it. Number one, Argentina. It was back in 2015 that strange markings and fields were first reported in the northern province of Salta. Mm. It baffled police as well as crop circle investigator Mercedes Casas. She was quoted saying, The pattern in this case is of nine circles that start big and get smaller as you move along. As you can see from the pictures, the pattern is very intricate and would be very difficult for any group of humans to pull off. The picture, though, does not do it justice. The large circle is an astonishing seven meters in diameter, and the smallest is four meters. Connecting them all creates a line that is one meter across. Mercedes believes this is the work of extraterrestrial beings in disguise as humans. She describes them as tall and blonde beings. Wow. Of course, others are writing these off as nothing more than a prank. A professor from Truman State University says, all fall within the range of the sort of thing done in hoaxes. Although obscure natural causes or alien origins of crop circles are suggested by fringe theorists, there is no specific evidence for such explanations, and human causes are consistent for all crop circles. Mm. Whoever side you're on, we can all agree that it's very unsettling. If they were the work of extraterrestrials, what were they trying to tell us? True. Number two, most complex in Britain. Our next ones may not be explained away as easily as the others. Back in June of 2008, three separate crop circles were spotted with a drone. The most intriguing one was an incredible 150 or 45 meters in diameter. The most mind-melting thing about this one, however, is how mathematically accurate it is. Astrophysicist Michael Reed believes it is representing the first ten digits of pi. He went on to say, The tenth digit has been correctly rounded up. The little dot near the center is the decimal point. The code is based on ten angular segments with the radial jumps being the indicator of each segment. Starting in the center and counting the number of one-tenth segments in each section contained by the change in radius, clearly shows the values of the first ten digits in the value of pi. The other two circles are equally as intricate and seem to have some type of deeper meaning also. I'm not sure how a group of people could have pulled this off with such mathematical precision. Mm. With that said, if it wasn't extraterrestrial, what are they trying to communicate by showing us they know how to illustrate pi in such a unique way? That's true. Number three, Russian drone footage. More recently, in August of 2013, an individual flying a drone captured an astonishing sight. The circles seen in this video range from 60 to 150 feet, or 18 to 45 meters in diameter. All five of the huge circles are connected by straight lines, and there are other smaller lines branching off of those. The strangest thing about this crop circle in particular is that scientists claim electromagnetic radiation and energy was used to make the crops fall the way that they did. They're currently conducting tests to see if this holds up. Of course, though, you have those claiming it is nothing more than a large group of paranormal enthusiasts. They back this claim by the fact that the same exact pattern appeared only 10 years ago in the same field. That poses the question, was it a hoax? Right. Or did we just miss the message the first time the extraterrestrials left it? Wow. Number 4. Wiltshire, Southwest England. According to sources, this circle appeared in what seems to be a hot spot. Places very near this one have been known to have multiple crop circle sightings over the years. This one, however, has something very different about it. Wow. The geometric style cube in the middle has left many people baffled. At 200 feet, or 60 meters in diameter, this is one of the largest circles on the list. While not as intricate as some, the flower-type design around the cube along with the concentric circles surrounding them require an impressive amount of skill. Mm. Many believers have found quite a bit of meaning in it as well, regarding the implied six-sided cube and the seven petals of the flower. Wow. Here's a quote from their webpage. The marriage of six and seven is interesting. Seven is the virginal number, the sacred mysterious feminine that guards what lies behind the veil. Six is the harmonious structure, order and function of the world. Together they create the transcendent transformational number 13. There's a deep meaning to be contemplated in this circle regarding the number of combinations and their relationship and positioning to one another. Unlike so much of the world these days, the crop circles require time, patience, and commitment of self to understand them. 
True. Far from being instantly decipherable codes, they often have hidden depths to explore. Sometimes that takes time. So again, could this be extraterrestrials trying to communicate that they know more about us than we think? Mm. Number 5. Broad Hilton Wiltshire We've saved the most interesting for last. Funny enough, it's not technically a circle, but the wow. sheer mathematical precision that goes into this one was too amazing to leave out. This one appeared overnight with another, more traditional design, appearing near it in a parallel field. While they're not sure if there is any correlation between the two, they have found some very deep meaning behind the pentagram. While most will look at it and immediately think of something evil and satanic, there was much more meaning behind the number five in this case. A quote pulled from their site states, Five is the number of life, and the ratios of the pentagon generate the golden section proportion in the Fibonacci numbers. Five is also the number of man, as the number and the golden ratio generate his form. Five itself is known as the number of regeneration, as the golden ratio often dictates the proportions and growth patterns of living things. The affinity we have with five, and in particular five-pointed stars, can be seen reflected in the number of times it is used in logos and patterns in everyday life. Wow. So what do you think? Are these crop circles all part of a worldwide elaborate hoax? Or is there more to them than meets the eye? Dang, bruh. Thank you for actually letting me react to this video. You know what I'm saying? Go follow Let's Read. You know what I'm saying? On Twitter, you feel me? You know what I mean? Sorry about the lighting, y'all. You know what I'm saying? I gotta get that fixed and stuff like that, y'all. I already know what it is. You know what I'm saying? But at least I put a reaction video out for y'all, man. Hey, man. I already subscribed to this person already. Let's read. You know what I'm saying? And thank you so much for actually letting me react. It's always good to ask permission first. Instead of just going in and say, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and just download it and then react to it. You know what I'm saying? So... I made sure that I asked that person, I asked him first to, can I react to this video? It's very important, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, I'm going to make sure that I, um, pinned his, um, his channel in the comment, you know what I'm saying? Y'all already know what it is, 2019, I'm glad that I actually got a chance to react to this. Thank you for actually letting me react to your video, man. It's very important. I like science stuff, too, as well, y'all. If y'all did not know, I love science, you know what I'm saying? So, he says, being said, thank you for watching. And if you want me to do another reaction video like this, y'all should definitely let me know. And make sure you subscribe if you are new, you know what I'm saying? And if y'all want me to react to Star Wars or Dragon Ball Z previews and stuff like that, y'all definitely should let me know. All right, I'm out. Peace out. Yo! Top rank shit, it is. That A-Town shit, you feel me?